Hi everybody, and welcome to today's Elevate Tours by Diesel Ducey unboxing. Today, we have a very exciting item to unbox. Let's just say, this is the first time I've bought a brand new computer in 10 years, since 2013, so. We're gonna go ahead and get to opening this thing up. This is the box that came in from FedEx. And it looks like it has this fun little pull tab to open it with, so let's do that. All right. Let's open this box. All right, guys, I'm excited. Y'all ready to see what's in this box? Let's pull it open. Wow. This box is beautiful. This is actually a pretty neat shipping cart. So, let's take the MacBook Pro out of the shipping cart. It's kind of dusty. So here is the box the MacBook Pro comes in. This is a simple but beautiful box now that we've got it brushed off. So let's take a quick look at this box before we actually open it. Just says MacBook Pro on it. On the back, it has a label that has the identifying information, which MacBook Pro 16 inch model number looks like A2780. Now, I've always wanted to do these. We got these magic pull tabs, so we are going to go ahead and pull them. Here we go. I love that sound. All right, are we ready? We're gonna lift off the box. I am so excited about this, y'all. My first brand new computer in 10 years. Oh my gosh, there it is, there it is. We're not gonna take it out of its paper yet, but we're gonna lift it up. So obviously we have the computer. The battery charger, it's a braided MagSafe 3 cable. So yeah, look at that. There's the battery charger. USB-C. Designed by Apple in California. MacBook Pro. Looks like it's a quick start guide. Welcome to your MacBook Pro. Automatically starts up when you lift up the lid. We'll do that here in a minute. Ooh, look at this. We have black Apple stickers. I like those. Is that all that's in here? Huh, Alexa doesn't know. Well, I feel like that's all that's in here. It's got this really thick padded envelope for two pieces of paper. And the last item is in the box is this huge battery charger. This is a huge charger, y'all. We'll go ahead and take this paper off it. Ooh, I love that sound. This is the gigantic 140 watt, I believe it's 140 watt power brick for the MacBook Pro. So that's what's in the box. Nothing else under here. So here it is, this moment I've probably been waiting for for years but didn't even know I really needed it. And I must say a huge thank you to my wonderful father and everyone who has given on GoFundMe to enable me to afford this computer. This computer has the 38-core uh, processor, 64 gigs of RAM, and a 4 terabyte SSD. So let's go ahead and open it up. Wow. Oh my gosh. 
This is just gorgeous. This is gorgeous. There is the computer. It's got a little smudge on it from the factory. That's wonderful. <laughs> it's gone now. Now we are going to open this computer for the first time and watch it power on. Here we go. Look at that. Hello. Let's take a look at the computer. What a beautiful keyboard. So here it is. That is the unboxing of the MacBook Pro. Now we've got to get this thing set up, which will probably take a day or two. And as soon as I start setting it up, it's already doing a software update. So there's been a software update since this thing last left the factory a couple weeks ago. But there it goes. Let's see what happens now. We're going to try the migration assistant to get everything off that computer onto that computer. On this final part of this uh, video, I'm going to show you some real world usage. Like this, I bought this mainly for video editing. And I'm going to show you how fast this thing can render and export 4K timeline. I have a minute and 57 clip up. We'll say it's two minutes. And I'm just going to adjust the brightness on it just to force it to render. So with that being said, we got a stopwatch here. We're going to go and make it render. There we go. Now we're rendering. Two minutes of 4K60 took 26 seconds. On my 2015 inch MacBook Pro, that would have probably taken about 10 minutes. All right, now we are going to export this video because it's pretty much ready to go up on YouTube. This is a long elevator in St. Louis, so I'm going to hit the share button. I have a YouTube preset, which I believe is H.264. As soon as I hit the uh, share button, let me title it real quick. All right, we got the video titled um, 4K60 MP4. We're going to hit the export button and time it and see how quick it goes. Here we go. You can see it exporting. Notice how the fans aren't even kicking in. This machine is barely even warm. All right, to export a two minute and 20 second video, it took just over a minute and a half. On my old machine, this would have probably taken over 10 minutes. So as you can see, this computer is a lot faster. And again, I must say a huge thanks to my father and the GoFundMe supporters. And more importantly, thank you to all of y'all for even getting me in a situation to where I need a computer to actually edit videos. Because if it wasn't for you guys, I wouldn't even need this machine. So with that being said, thank you for watching. Hope you all enjoyed this video. And that will be it. Until next time, bye y'all. A huge thank you to all of my patrons for your support of Elevate Tours. The video's over, but it doesn't have to be. You can always watch more, and you know what to do. And don't forget to subscribe and light up that bell. Until next time, bye y'all.